Hi, I'm Tony Fleming, and this is Fleming's Ultimate Garage. Fresh arrival today, one of my all-time favorites, 69 Camaro Super Sport Convertible. Le Mans blue, white stripes, you know, it's uh, colors like that, that when this car rolls down the road, everybody knows what it is because they just don't paint cars in this color anymore. Some cars have some style like this car does, but they just don't look the same and I don't know why. It's just something about these cars. So when you're looking for cars like this, let's talk a little bit about paint quality, which we try to do as much as we can. Come on over and check this out. You know, you want to be able to read uh, everything in here nice and clear. And the reason you want to do that is because pictures can hide, uh, it'll look like it's shiny, but it really doesn't have great shine. It just looks like uh, decent paint. This is great shiny paint. A couple things that you forget to ask about because you know if you're if it's your first time getting into a muscle car, uh, you know you're used to your daily driver. For instance, like this car has power disc brakes, and power disc brakes uh, were not standard on every car back then. As a matter of fact, most cars had drum brakes, and the fact that this has power disc brakes makes it really nice. A couple other nice features: it's got the fast ratio power steering, which I love. Great features that we talked about: the cowl induction hood, and when we open the hood, uh, you'll see the 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 finishing point of the car is here. And the reason I say the finishing point of the car is here is this car here, uh, when you decide to buy this car, if you don't live locally, our prices include free and closed door-to-door -door shipping. I've also gone through the car front to back to make sure the seat belts are working properly, uh, the turn signals work, the headlights work, the high beams work, uh, that the brakes are adjusted and they're all good. The, uh, uh, the steering, the belts, the hoses, everything, we've made sure that the car gets a complete two-hour checkover, then it gets the work done to it. The two-hour checkover is just to find out uh, what it's like and the drivability. The one thing sneaky about this particular car here is it looks very stock until I start it. And then once I start it, I think you'll hear that this car is far from stock. But it's really cool because it's not ridiculously loud and still makes good uh, vacuum so the power disc brakes work properly. And uh, But the one thing it is is when you tip into it, it rolls on down the road. Let's pop the hood for a second and check it out. One thing I want to show you real quick is uh, this is where people get cheap sometimes. These can be ordered in plastic. These are stainless, and they're the most expensive that you can buy because they have the Chevrolet Motor Division in them, so they're GM approved, as well as these right here are polished stainless. They're not plastic chrome. All new chrome and stainless around the car. We talked about the front and rear bumpers, which I, I mean front and rear spoilers, which I love. Okay, a little more detail, and just walk with me for a minute. Humor me while I talk about the detail different color painted latches. A lot of people spray bomb the entire engine compartment black, right? Because then it looks a little fresher, it's all uniform. Not here, not the case. The latch here is painted a different color. It's got the correct stickers, it's got a nice battery topper on it, Cal induction air cleaner and hood. This is a little bit over restored, quite honestly. It's a little nicer than it may have rolled out of the factory. And if you're gonna show this car, it shows really nicely. If you're gonna take it to national judging, you may run into a couple issues. I don't really care about national judging because I love a great looking car that I can show up uh, at a cruise night and not get beat up on. Even things like the hinges are painted a different color, the springs are. This is a little glossier right here, the inner fender liners, uh, than they're supposed to be. The power steering box, looks like it's an upgraded unit, so it's gonna be the fast ratio power steering, which I really like. It's got the horns that are working. This little stuff that we talk about, the marker lights. Uh, those all are part of the package of when we deliver this car to you, okay? Let's take a peek inside for a second. For me, when I'm talking about Camaros, I love a console. Whether it's supposed to have it or not, I think the console is one great feature. The dash has all been restored here. The blower works, the heat works. These are all things that you're gonna find out once you get uh, that car that you don't buy from us uh, home. You're gonna have to take it to your mechanic, he's gonna go through, he's gonna hand you a bill for $2,500 and say, listen, I fixed the interior lights. The interior lights, by the way, work in this car when you open the doors. I fixed the power top so it went quicker. This top up and down beautifully, nice and easy. Three spoke wheel, all the gauges work. This has an additional set of auto meters right here. And if you want to, we can install a digital sound system and hide it in the glove box with CD, iPod, things like that. Let's take a peek in the trunk for a second. This is uh, a Super Sport. The stripes, they stop at the right spot. This is not painted flat back, flat black because it's not a 396. It's painted body color like it's supposed to. I just want to show you the detail and I keep uh, saying this, new seals. Somebody's put a spare tire in here and they have jack and they've restored the jack. 
Still has the cocktail shakers to keep the vibration down in the back of these convertibles from the factory. They haven't been cut out. Nicely wet sanded inside of the trunk. Stickers. Enough said. Can we take a peek down here for a second? All new gas tank lines, brakes. Look how nice everything looks under there. The idea is that you get in this car and you go for a ride. But I do want to do this for you. I want to start it because uh, this car, with this particular Camaro, and since it's one of our most popular units, sometimes sound different than others, and this car sounds great. Now that's one great sounding Camaro. Le Mans blue, white stripes, Great motor, great detail, uh, power disc brakes, power steering, power top. You know, this is the car, man. If you can afford to get a car like this, it's priced in the 30s. It is a spectacular uh, value for the money, for the amount of effort that's been put in it to restore it. It's great looking. You'll really, really like this car. Anyway, call us 301-816-1000 and we'll tell you all about it.